Are you ready? You ready? Let's we go. are underway. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Opens with the left hand and lands flush. St. Pierre goes for the takedown and misses. Well played on the head kick. Just misses with the jab. Nice punch there by Magni. Beautiful leg kick. Looks like he's trying to set up a takedown here. There's the attempt. GSP gets in the clinch. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground. Staying busy. Trademark inside leg kick there by Magni. First takedown attempt is there. Oh, right hand is there for him, Joe. Now that he's mounted, he's got to control his posture. Nice punch by George St. Pierre. Now he's in half guard. Oh, he lands a elbow. huge elbow to the head. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Over under hooks here. Magni gets back up and pretty quickly, I might add. He hip escapes from the full mount. He's trying to pass here. Now he moves to full guard. Big Ooh. elbow. Big Beautiful body, body shot. shot there, too. Oh, he connected with an elbow. Ooh, postures up and now goes with the big strike to the body. Well done there by George St. Pierre. Magny gets back up again. Powerful leg kick from St. Pierre. St. Pierre gets caught with that punch. Oh, excellent exchange there. Man, he just gets better with every fight. Another kick to the leg landed there by GSP. And from here, transitions to the Muay Thai clinch. St. Pierre. Oh! Big knee! What an end to round one! by the bell. That's the end of the round. You heard the horn, and it came just as he... Big round. Okay, you ready? Round two. Ready? All right, round two. Now, starting off this round, he might still be hurt. He's going to want to look to be defensive and move and avoid getting hit and try to recover. Good strike there by Mag. Visibly limping here. Head kick. See the total strikes. George St. Pierre with another vicious leg kick. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there. Oh, that's some wrestling right there. Posture's up here. Oh, tags him with that funny left again. He's in half guard. Magni gets caught with that punch. Into side control again. Excellent movement here on the ground. All right, hammer fist here by George St. Pierre. In full guard. Under three minutes here to go in round two. He's in full guard here. He's looking for the triangle. He's got the leg over the shoulder. Now, he's gonna pull down on his shin. 
Looks like he's got that triangle locked into place and very tight. Nicely done. Excellent posture. Escapes up to his feet. Very nice. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. Under two minutes now to go in the round. Switching stances here. Magny's got that over under here in the clinch. Let's see what he can do with it. Nice job staying busy here in the clinch. While the body was wide open, his opponent took advantage. Kick to the body, lands flush. Oh! Whoa! He's got him hurt here. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. That one hurt. He moves to the Muay Thai clinch. But oh, 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 he stuns it. This could be it. like the last round, one of these guys is going out. I can't imagine a scenario where if they continue where they left off in the last round, that one of these guys doesn't get knocked out. Oh, beautiful takedown. He hits him with a hammer fist. Another hard hammer fist. He's looking to pass. Looking for a triangle, throws one leg over the shoulder. He got it out of the triangle. Magni gets caught with that punch. He goes upstairs for an elbow. Plans Huge a big elbow, elbow there. to the head. Back to the feet. Nice leg kick. Looks like his leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. Oh, he is starting to put a lot more pressure on his opponent here, Joe. A lot lighter on his feet these last couple rounds of this fight. Great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. Look at this, looking for a triangle. Under a minute to go here in our third He's free for the triangle. He tries to pass here, but gets shut down. It looks like he may be attempting a submission here. Then he's out. We'll see what he does here. He postures up and lands to the head. St. Pierre gets back up again. Nicely done. George St. Pierre with a nasty leg kick. And he lands that leg kick again. They go the 15-minute distance. What a fight. 
All right, so there's the final horn, and at times in this one, you didn't think we'd get there. We go the distance, he nearly won the fight by submission, and perhaps just that submission attempt and that activity was enough to give him the nod in the eyes of the judges. Still, though, a fight here, Joe, that could go either way. Here's Bruce Buffer. It's certainly a competitive fight, it's certainly close. To go to the judges for cards for a decision. For the winner by split decision, Neil Magny! So how about this Neil Magny cat? All he does is win. Forget the betting odds, throw those away. Forget the film breakdown. Magny just finds a way to win, finds a way to get his hand raised. Some have called him an overachiever. I'll just say he's a welterweight contender with about as much heart, desire, and upside as any in this division.